So I want to bring heaven to earth. Uh, something I've been thinking about for quite a long time. Uh, pretty, pretty deeply on how it could be done and what to do. And the best way to make it play out. And I, it's such a simple, easy fix uh, that it could, it could absolutely be doable. Um, I just don't know. For one, I would like to get rid of money. I just don't know how to go about how how it would be possible to do away with money completely. Uh, someone I've talked to about this said that a barter system would come into play or something of that nature, which uh, if it could work, it would be fantastic. But the simple, quick, easy fix uh, to turn this place into heaven is... Now, I'm gonna, first, I'm going to speak on the realm of possibilities that's actually possible at this very moment and then another one uh, i'm going to take a step towards some pretty fantastical things so uh, you know just stay with me here quick simple easy fix at the first part we do universal basic income for everyone everyone gets a house everyone and let me when i say everyone i don't mean everyone just gets a new house i mean if there's homeless people they get a home uh Everyone would get food. Everyone would get electricity. Everyone would get water. So simple and so easy. And I've already laid out how it's possible to do this uh, money-wise. Because at the end of the day, money is just something that we've made up. It's imaginary. And we just go along with it. And think that it's something important. So you do the universal basic income, do the housing, do the food, do the water, do the electricity. That's a pretty quick, simple, easy fix. And something else that we would have to do, you know, God forbid that's hard to do, is treat everyone along the way you would want to be treated. Stop looking at fucking skin color. Stop looking at, uh, just, do you see how stupid this stuff is, though? Like, why, why do people focus on skin color? Why do people focus on if you're a male or a female? Why do people focus on uh, if you like men or women? Or all, all this craziness. It's like, I don't, I don't care. And you shouldn't either. Like, treat people the way you'd want to be treated. People's going to have, you know, people's going to have to let a lot of shit go. I'm just going to have to let the shit go. That in itself, right there, would bring upon the world peace. It absolutely would. If people could look at different perspectives and want to treat others the way they want to be treated and quit living in such a materialistic world, I mean, it's just insane. Why would no one want to do this? Why would no one want to accomplish this? There is no good reason not to. Absolutely no good reason not to. You can't think of a single good reason... That is not selfish or egotistical to not want to do that. No good reason. We absolutely need to get rid of borders. I mean, we're on a planet, supposedly. No one owns this. No one. And if you want to say God owns it, then okay, great. But no one here has the authority or ability to say once you cross this line, I can arrest you for crossing a line on a planet that we all share. It's just absolute insanity. And I do not understand why people go along. Well, I do actually understand why people go along with it. Because of media. And they have been programmed and brainwashed to think there's some dire consequence. And they get fear installed in them. But if everybody could just drop the shit, treat people the way they'd want to be treated, stop seeing, stop letting fear control them, and stop just going along with stuff, we could absolutely accomplish this. This is something that I, I don't understand more people don't grasp and realize or understand the concept of. You're going along with the worst of things, and you're acting like there is nothing you can do about it. We are the majority. We can absolutely make this happen. We can make it work it is 100% possible and I do believe something big is about to happen I really do I can feel it I can sense it 
So, these things are not hard to accomplish at all. Like, here, listen to how simple that is to fix. Listen to how just, it's so simple, it's stupid. Do you understand? It's so simple that it is stupid. So simple. When I say stupid, it's stupid. No one's doing this, and it's not already been done. Now, if I can get into the more fantastical parts of this, and also, obviously, free health care would be involved in that. Obviously, free uh, education. If you want to go become a doctor or a veterinarian or a lawyer or a surgeon or whatever, psychiatrist, psychologist, whatever you want to be. And on top of this, now if I can get into the more fantastical things, this would be absolutely amazing to do. I just think people have to believe it can be done, and it can, quite possibly can be done. I would like to end uh, disease. I would like to end illnesses. I would like to extend human life, if at all possible. I think now the average human life span is 80 years. I would like to push that more closer to 200 years if possible. I would also like to, and these are, these are not even, now that might seem fantastical, but I believe it can be done. Now the next thing is, can still be done now. We need to treat our environment and nature better because it's it's pretty much what it's one of the most beautiful parts about this place and it's not going to do anything when you're going through cities and there's smog everywhere and you can't see and they're just cutting trees down left and right uh, and all these things it's i'm not entirely sure i believe in climate change i don't know but it would be very nice to end that if it if it is a thing so these things are just so, it's not even out of the realm of possibilities. It's its not even something that fantastical would have to happen. It's something we can do and accomplish. It's So I'm not, I don't understand why people just can't work towards this and try to make this actualize. You know what I'm saying? It baffles me that it's not already transpired or happened uh, if you believe any human history or you believe much about anything, it's it's crazy that it took this long for. Um, it's, I don't know. I just don't understand why people have not thought of this and tried to incorporate it and do it. And the only reason I can think of is, again, it's greed, selfishness, it's ego. It's people just go along with things. This is wild to me. People go along with things for no apparent reason. People think that other people have the answers for it or know better than them. And that's not the case. I can tell you that's the trap with a lot of things here. It's the trap with religion. It's the trap with almost, any, almost anything you can think of. Because you're always looking for someone else for the answer. Or you're just assuming someone else knows the answer or knows better than you. And I'm telling you, I'm telling you that's not the case. You need to wake up to that. Fully wake up. But these things we can do, it can be done to bring heaven to earth. Now, your definition of heaven may be different. It, you've probably not played out an eternity in your head. But if you played out eternity in your head, you'll realize what I just proposed is a pretty, pretty good place to start, at the very least. And if, and if it's not even just a place to start, it may be the answer to solve everything. But uh, I do love you guys. It's just, it's a game of form and a play of life. And I, I need you to fully wake up. Because we are going to bring heaven to earth. In one way or the other. Preferably sooner than later. And I have a pretty good feeling that it's, it, it's going to be sooner. A lot sooner than later. Game of form and a play of life. I'm you talking to you. Let's fix it.